Pisces, this is your weekly reading for April 1st through the 7th. Let's go ahead and jump in with each other. Hope all of you guys are doing well out there. You are focused on yourself and you are creating your happiness, okay? Let's see what angel number is here for you, Pisces. What message do you have for Pisces? I keep seeing this number two, Pisces. You guys have 1212 as your first angel number. <laughs> and your positive affirmation is, I am focused. And yes, you need to be. Stay focused, Pisces, on your best possible future and remain optimistic throughout the entire journey. Your angels are right behind you as you turn your dreams into reality here. And though... Although some of you guys may not feel this way, some of you guys do, but some of you guys may not feel this way here, okay? You may be um, moving into this energy here this week. You're understanding that everybody can't go with you towards success. You're learning to let go of things that are out of your control and let go of people that um, that may pose a, 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 seem to be a stumbling block. Okay, when it comes to your success, your peace of mind, and your happiness here, okay, Pisces. Your second angel number is 929. Okay, spirit is saying a period of going through upheaval and drastic changes. Spirit is trying to prevent this stagnant energy from coming into your life, or if it's already in your life, it's showing you a clear and easy way out. And sometimes that's not always easy, especially when you're dealing with people that you may care a lot about or dealing with the situation that you're very passionate about okay but spirit is letting you know here pisces that this week you guys need to commit to change okay spirit is saying this is a gentle warning here okay let's see what else is going on for you guys this week pisces they're wanting you definitely to commit to change here and remain focused on your best possible future here this week and for the next several weeks here. I feel like there may be some drastic changes for you. For some of you guys, you are trying to uh, make very important decisions here this week here. Um, it feels like some of you guys are, are deciding to do something that will change your life uh, forever, but in a positive way here, not in a chaotic way okay definitely you have the page of wands that is coming in you guys have the eight of swords that's coming in here you no longer want to be tied down okay you're going towards uh new opportunities here in your life and you're allowing yourself to be very creative you may be focus <laughs> just like your card is saying this 1212 card focus on your work okay dedicated to your work and learning more about your job or whatever um career or projects that you guys are thinking about some of you guys are thinking about uh creating um secondary or third or fourth streams of income for yourself some of you guys are thinking about going back to school this week or taking up training classes um, online or in person here to uh, perfect your skills okay it tells me that you want to perfect your skill set here okay and you're just tired of being trapped in a situation with a person or dealing with a situation that may be dragging you down. I feel like, Pisces, you guys have bright ideas about what your future is here this week. And you're definitely moving towards it in a very mild way. Okay, with the strength card that's coming in. Spirit is saying you're going to be very successful at the heart of the matter with the six of wands. And it feels really good. Don't think that drama won't try to follow you here though. Okay, there may be some ups and downs. There may be some competition here, but I don't feel like it's anything that you cannot overcome that you cannot deal with. And spirit is saying walk away from drama with the five of wands that's coming in here. Don't give it your time or your attention here, Pisces. Continue to focus on yourself, just like your card is saying. Repeat that affirmation. I 
am focused. Every time you feel like your attention is being drawn towards something someone is trying to do to you, trying, okay? <laughs> because where attention goes, energy flows, okay? So do not put your attention on people that are trying to bring you down. Remove yourself from a situation here. Free yourself, free your mind from someone that is definitely trying to keep you in a very confined and worried state mentally some of you guys need to do this physically um commit to change physically here okay i'm definitely feeling like spirit is saying with this angel number 929 that this is a gentle warning here pisces because you could be missing out on amazing opportunities if you keep going back for people if you keep giving over your energy if you keep giving over your attention and your time to these individuals or these situations here okay there's nothing wrong with helping anyone but you do need to stay focused on your own energy just like i posted on my community page okay that you need to remain focused on your energy here okay because this is where you'll continuously be if you um i feel don't uh Focus on yourself, this nine of swords type of energy. Someone's going to continuously have you stressed out by creating conflict in their life so you can handle it or in your life here, okay, with that nine of swords. And I definitely feel like you guys, it could be a lover or someone that you love with the lover's card that's coming out here, okay? This person is creating blocks and obstacles, but with the dreamer card, the fool card that's coming out, spirit is saying that it's time for a new start here. It's time for a fresh new mindset and attitude here as you move forward, Pisces, in your life, okay? So focus on pushing aside your fears here when it comes to doing things that are not in your comfort zone, okay? Um, sometimes... <laughs> I feel like Pisces, you help other people so much that you fear that if you take your attention away from them, something is going to happen, okay? But it's, it, what's going to happen is that you're going to improve. That's the only thing that's going to happen is your life will improve here. And I feel like uh, intuitively someone is afraid of you finding yourself. Someone's afraid of you finding your true self beauty that you hold inside okay so spirit wants you to focus on meditating and exercising and eating better and drinking more water okay and taking care of your beautiful self here pisces your card says as your body becomes stronger you begin to feel stronger in all ways mentally physically emotionally spiritually that's why i'm telling you to meditate as well okay even if you do some exercises at home for 30 minutes, okay, that is going to benefit you greatly. Your body will start to uh, feel much stronger. Your mind will feel much stronger, okay? Organize yourself, okay? Focus on yourself here. You have uh, flower power that's coming in spend time with flowers in nature and flower essences do some uh aromatherapy sessions with yourself while you're meditating you can go get aromatherapy um uh what do you call those send things okay at walmart it's cheap <laughs> okay you drop put put some essential oils in there let the mist take you away put on some nice calm music or whatever music that you enjoy and let that scent okay uh that aromatherapy uh help you ease the tension and stress that you have inside of you okay so flower essences use them to increase your personal healing powers here okay to cleanse your chakra heart chakra here and your throat chakra as well um some of you guys your solar plex plexus and your root chakra needs to be aligned as well you can do some therapy with sound and vibrations here as well here on youtube you can definitely find videos for that okay some of you guys have marriage coming in here okay
So I feel like some relationship definitely may be affecting you in some way. Some of you guys, you may have a love. Let, we'll clarify this, but you may have a love coming in that's going to be very successful. Maybe an Aries, Leo, Sagittarius person. Or you guys have a love, okay? Lover that you have to make a decision on here because you feel very bound or stuck with this person here and the energy just does not feel very inviting uh you feel lost in this connection here let's take a look at what this energy is talking about here what's going on with pisces and love why is this marriage card here and a lover's card here for Pisces? Let's take a look at my singles first. Okay, we're going to break it down just a little bit. What's going on with my singles? Singles, you have the Eight of Cups that is coming in here. And you also have the Page of Wands. And you have the page of coins here. So my single people, you may have dealt with a very shaky or rough uh, relationship here in the past with the eight of cups. Someone that you may have had to walk away from. Someone that you had to leave. Okay, leaving dark times and moving towards karma waters or greener pastures here right now singles you are very focused possibly on your work your coins um money uh becoming more um stable financially and physically here okay will love come in towards my singles, I see that you will have an option here, singles, since we have the lover's card and this marriage card that's showing up for you. There may be a message coming in from an air sign or a, I'm sorry, a fire sign or a um, <laughs> fire sign or uh, an earth sign here, okay? This person is marriage material, just to let you know with the King of Wands that's showing up for you. It's someone that you're going to have to take your time with, though. That's what I feel. To get comfortable with this person, learn all you can about this person, okay? Um, but there is a message of love coming in towards you. Let's take a look at my couples, okay? Spirit, what is going on with my coupled Pisces? What's happening in their connection you have the six of coins that's showing up for you you also have the four of coins that's coming up for you some of you guys are trying to hold on to a connection on to a relationship here you also have the judgment card here i feel like you're you're going to try to continue to work on your relationship on your connection here okay there definitely will be some breakdown of this relationship uh on a spiritual level that's what i'm feeling okay but i feel like i feel like there will be positive uh, breakthroughs with this judgment card and this six of coins here you're going to see your partner wanting to work with you wanting to help you mentally uh and physically uh succeed here in life and in the relationship here okay this person does care about you they do love you here i don't feel like this is any past person that's coming back to damage your relationship with this judgment card i just feel like it is you and your person working towards improving the relationship here but it's going to take time Time. that's what I feel I feel like there will be some uh, complete um, there's gonna be some breakthrough within the next four weeks here okay some confessions coming in or important heart-to-heart -heart conversations that you and your person will be having make sure that you are speaking from the heart here okay that's why i'm telling you to do some therapy when it comes to your throat chakra here pisces and your heart chakra include your lover okay if you want to see change here okay you have the chariot card i see you guys moving forward together here this person is going to become the partner that you need them to be here you're going to see them working very closely with you to get their needs met and to meet your needs as well make sure you're doing the same thing with them here pisces but i don't see you guys separating i do see you guys working together to keep the relationship going to keep it healthy or working towards a healthy connection and healthy relationship with each other here okay
that is your reading Pisces thank you so much for coming back to watch your reading make sure you guys like the video subscribe to the channel and hit that notification bell and I will see you in your next reading bye